Yeah. The rewards of self-belief have turned me into an addict. Yeah. Girls cheating, being hoes has turned me into a savage. Before I knew I what is going on, guys? I'm Gabo here with another video for you today, and today we're gonna be playing some more of the Half Past Eight series. Last time we got through with Chapter Five, so now we're gonna be going into Chapter Six, about halfway through the game. Uh, yeah. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Yo. All right. Four years ago. Going pretty far back now. Chapter 6. That's a pretty nice theater. I like that. Oh, it's Bia again. Nice. I'm so excited for you, Jody. Your film in a film festival? This is every film student's dream. I feel like I'm going to have a panic attack. What if no one shows up to the screening? It's going to be fine. I'm here. Your sister is here. Mara only came because I forced her to. Even so, there are so many people from school who bought tickets. Even Milo is coming. Yeah, I guess. Speaking of Milo, are you two still exchanging letters to snail mail? Hey, I love snail mail. <laughs> There's something about it. a handwritten letter on the cute stationery. They have old school charm to them. It's a lost art, you know? Pens, paper, handwriting. It's very intimate and personal. I get it, I get it. I've heard this rant before. How's Milo doing, by the way? I haven't seen him in ages. Not since he moved away after we graduated. He's doing fine, in case you haven't heard. Apparently, his girlfriend and is his fiance now, and the wedding is coming up. That kind of sucks. I, I kind of wanted them to be together. I know, right? It's really making me feel old. Yeah, same here, I guess. Anyway, will you help me uh, hand out more of these promotional tickets? I just want to make sure I have, we have, I have a full audience. Of course, you'll do. No, uh, not that you need it, but yes, I'll do it if it makes you feel better. I'm also going to see if I can find some tickets for Milo. He mentioned in his last letter there was a film he wanted to see. It's called Odore. Apparently the ticket sold out really fast and he wasn't able to get one. I'm going to see if I can find any here. Alright, Milo said we wouldn't, uh, he wouldn't be here for a while, so you have some time. Just don't forget to hand out those tickets. Uh, she earned this. Yeah. Merch. Uh, oh, this is her sister. Okay. She wants to eventually start her own tip. God damn it. Everything is fucking connected. <laughs> Hello? Oh, sorry. I was thinking about something. No problem. What's bothering you? It's something work related. Don't worry about it. You're Jody's friend, right? Yeah, I'm Bia. You must be Mara. Jody's sister? Nice to finally meet you. Yes, I am. Nice to meet you too. It's great to, uh, you came to Jody's showing. Yeah, I took some time off so I could come see it. And I'm very proud of her. So what do you do for work? I used to be an engineer, but I've always wanted to start my own energy company. Wow, that's really impressive, especially since you're so young. Thanks, but I wish things moved even faster. I've been stuck on something in my research for almost a year now. I'm so sorry to hear that. Well, I know I won't be able to help you on any engineering things, but whenever I'm stuck in photography, I always try to swap out some lenses or reframe the shot just to get a new perspective. Sometimes I also take a walk. Or maybe just listen to some... Wait. What did you say? Um, sometimes I take a walk. No, before that. About your cameras. Oh, uh, I'd swap out the camera lenses and reframe the shot. Hmm, reframing. If I can calibrate the lens swapping based on the subframe inputs, then the output should be much more consistent. At least enough to power common household appliances, making it market friendly. Wow, I think I just got it. You're a genius. Uh, I am. I'm glad I helped. <laughs> okay, when is this thing over again? I need to get back to work immediately. Or can I just leave right now? Well, I'm sure Jody would appreciate if you stayed and supported her. Yeah, you're right. Thanks. You're a great help. Yeah. Uh, okay. Practically coma to oh, Jesus. <laughs> Sorry, um, 
Hi, can I can I help you? Are you okay? Uh, I'm terrible. I stayed up late last night and <laughs> just immediately. <clears throat> what? Oh, sorry. Yeah, I forgot I had to work today, so I stayed up late last night. It wouldn't have been too big of a deal, but I slept through my alarm and I didn't have time for breakfast. It's impossible to stay awake without fuel. I'm really sorry to hear that, but could you help me with something? Maybe if I had one of those zesty, damn, zesty what? God damn it. Uh, uh, I think this, ooh, zesty burrito. Zesty burrito. I already know where this is going. <laughs> What's good? Our zesty breakfast burrito is our top seller. We also have a regular breakfast burrito. Can I try the zesty breakfast burrito? Oh, I don't have any cash on me. Fuck. Okay. He looks like he's trying to sell some tickets. Maybe we have uh, the ones I need. You happen to have a door? Let me see. Well, I only have two left, and they're my last ones, and I was saving them. Would you be interested in some other screenings? I have some for the adventures of Kevin in the clouds. Please, I really just need the Dory tickets. How much would you want for them? All I want is to save them for some of my husband and I could go see the show. My husband is a huge fan. Isn't there any way you would uh, part with them? Sorry, honey. Well, actually, I'll tell you what. If you made it worth my while, I'd consider parting with them. What did you have in mind? Well, you see, the stupid... Uh, souvenir shop run of wizard boy hats that I, just before I got here my husband is a fan of the director of Doria but he's an even bigger fan of wizard boy if I have a wizard boy hat to trade I'd consider trading for the tickets darn okay sorry but that's the only way I'd part with them for sure one minute this is yep that's Oscar <laughs> God damn it. Alright, cool. Uh, Wizard Boy hat. You guys have Wizard Boy hats. This is the hippie from then, too. Okay. Okay, cool. He looks like he has. he's here to see Wizard Boy. Nice hat. Thanks. We're the Wizard Boys. Like from the movie? It's not just a movie. It's a way of life. <laughs> I don't really know. But it's really important to... Wait. I would never give up this hat. Goddamn, okay. What? Oh, I guess you're not really a fan. Oh, damn. Wow, call me out. The burritos here are so good. They just showed the, the business into the theater's concession stand already <laughs> right that'd be lovely what a cute couple they must be on a date oh how sweet i'm telling you dave i haven't seen the dog yet. What, what, uh, dave what, what's going on man why, why can't you just answer this guy <laughs> there aren't any dogs dave <laughs> they got here acting the whole fool all right what about you Wow, what are you playing? I love it. Thanks, dude. It's a little something I put together. You here to enjoy the film festival? Yes, I am. My college friends and I are all coming here to see a film one of my friends made. Right on. I love movies, man. Your friend must be a cool cat to be making their own. Are you here to see anything? Nah, I never picked up any tickets. It would be really cool to see something, though. I've been itching for a good film for a while. For now, I'm just here enjoying life to play some tunes to cheer folks up. Just, uh to be a part of the experience a friend of mine is always saying something similar he always says uh, people should collect more experiences than fewer things dude yes your friends sound like a wise man i tell you man i spent nearly all my life chasing after things money titles you name it i even started an investment company <laughs> but it wasn't until later in life that i realized the more i gave away the more i really had in life i have so much more now than i've ever had before Oh, that's beautiful. That's what life's all about, man. So you want some uh, some tickets? <laughs> I was wondering if you'd like one. Oh, sorry, man. I left my wallet at home today. Oh, don't worry. These are promotional tickets, so they don't really cost anything. No kidding. That's awfully generous of you. Yeah, I'll take one. Nice. 
As a token of my appreciation, I'd like you to have whatever is in my guitar case. It looks like there's about $8.50. Oh, I couldn't take your money. Hey, it's not about the money, man. It's about life and doing it right. And that means being a cool cat where you can. Alright, well, thank you. No, thank you. What kind of told you are. Nice. Thank you, man. I really do appreciate that. Do I have any more tickets? No, I do not. But I can get this zesty burrito. That's some cash. Awesome. Yes, please. Alright, coming right up. Had a quarter left over. I'll just put it in the chip jar. Thank you. And here's your burrito. Have a great dar. Uh, dar. Dar. Have a great dar. <laughs> Have a great day. Fuck. <laughs> if I could speak. You. You. No. Yeah, you. Zesty burrito. Hey, that smells good. Here, I got you a zesty breakfast burrito from the food truck outside. You should wake you up. Wow, this is zesty. <laughs> this is zesty. You were right. I feel all buzz. Thank you so much. I feel much more awake. Thanks again for that burrito. Uh, I needed that pick me up. So, did you want to buy anything? Wizard boy hat. Can I buy a souvenir? What can I get you? I need a wizard boy hat. Sorry, but we're all uh, wizard boy hats. Really? Are you sure? I really need one. Isn't there a wizard boy hat right here? Right there? Oh, that? Funny story. It's actually from a different movie. That's Kev uh, that's Kevin's hat from the adventures of Kevin in the clouds. That's silly. How are you doing? Oh, never mind. No, thank you. What is that? Why are you here? It's another one of those bunny toys things. Why is it hiding in the corner? I don't know, man. People, people weird. Alright. Hey! What you doing with the hat? Hi there. Oh, hi. Is something wrong? What? Oh, no. Well, yes, as a matter of fact, I bought this stupid hat yesterday for my son, but when I got home, I realized I bought the wrong one. It looked the same. How was I supposed to know another movie in the same theater would also have a wizard hat as a souvenir? I agree with you there. It's an odd coincidence. And the one my son uh, someone wants is still in stock, so I came back to exchange it, but they won't let me. I'm so sorry. That's frustrating. I guess this first one will do. It's not the one my son wanted, but something is better than nothing. Oh, but what if he doesn't like it? I don't know. Hello again. Oh, hi. Uh, you have the wizard boy hat, right? This? I don't know. It's But it's not the Kevin hat, that's for sure. Is there any way I could take it off your hands? The souvenir shop is really sold on. I really need the wizard boy hat. I'm sorry, but I bought... Okay. I'm just trying to decide if I want to buy the right one or not. Okay, well, here. I'll go buy the right one. And, and you give me that one. Can I buy a souvenir? Can in clouds hat, sure thing. Twenty bucks. But since you got me that burrito, I can give you the discount and I'll just take it out of my pay. How about just give me five bu bucks for it? Do you take cards? Indeed we do. Nice! Let's go. Alright, let me run that real quick and done. Here's your hat. Awesome. And real my boss would have killed me if she seen me like that. Oh well, I mean just don't stay hunched over too long. It's bad for your back. I say as I'm hunched up playing this game. I have the hat for you if you want to trade the wizard boy hat. Please, trade with me. It would mean the world. That may be the nerdiest thing I ever said. <laughs> wow, really? That's so kind of you. Yeah. Oh, my son will be so happy. Since he went off to college, I haven't gotten this far with what I, <laughs> the way I used to. I'm glad I'll be able to send him the right one. I'm glad I could help. Ah, he's in college. Nice. Also, I, I haven't really talked to this guy. No, oh, all oh, these shirts are cute. I wonder if Jody gets free shirts from being part of the film festival. I, sometimes, I, I, I know sometimes that stuff happens. Oscar, I have your hat. It wasn't easy, but I was able to find the wizard boy hat. Oh my gosh, awesome. Here, I'll trade you those Adori tickets you want. Really? Thank you so much. Thank you, Oscar. Wow, my husband is going to be so excited. The best deal I've made all day. Yeah, I could help. I should really go tell Jolie the good news. Nice. I gave out the tickets and everything. Oh, wow. Yo, is that the boy, Milo? 
Milo is here just in time oh that must be Stacy I didn't know she was coming it makes sense they are engaged after all well I should go say hi ah dude Bia it's been so good to see you you too Milo I'm so glad <laughs> you could make it Stacy this is my friend Bia it's great to finally meet you Bia it's good to finally meet you too I've heard a lot of things about you <laughs> it's all good I hope <laughs> see Bia I told you she was real <laughs> I never thought she wasn't real Milo we just talk about her all the time and I never met her I um, didn't know both of you were coming but this is such a pleasant surprise I figured with the wedding coming up Milo and I should spend more time together that's true yeah of course well you two made it just in time for Jody's film showing and she will be thrilled to see you both Bia, you've gone native. What happened to your accent? I kind of miss it. <laughs> I guess I'm local now. It must be because I've been watching a ton of films in English because of somebody. Does that mean you're almost caught up then? Oh, come on. Not even close. How many films do you think I can fit into my schedule every week, Milo? Well, maybe sh we should try to see some other showings while we're here. Make the most out of the trip and knock some of those films off your list, right? Oh, now that you mention it, I managed to find these tickets for you. They're for Adore. Wait, Adore? Isn't that the film you were telling me about, Milo? Yeah, gosh, Bia, how did you get these? Tickets have been sold out for months. It took some haggling, but I have my ways. There are only two tickets? Uh, yeah, I got them. For the two of you. Oh, well, thank you so much, Bia. Are you sure you don't want to go? You worked so hard to get the tickets and everything. No, no, they're for you two. It will be great memories for you. Thank you, Bia. That's really sweet. Milo was right about you. You're such a good friend. Bia, thank you so much. Well, I think Jolie's show starts soon. She'll probably, uh, she's probably starting to freak out. Let's head inside. Jolie has our tickets. Okay. <sighs> I was really hoping to see the phone with Milo and catch up with him. Oh, well. I guess I'm glad that Milo and Stacy got to get to share a great experience with each other. Ah, <sighs> damn it. Hey, Bia, are you coming? Yeah. Damn, all right. <laughs> Yesterday. Well, I think this is going to be the end of chapter six. A pretty short chapter. Yeah, end of chapter six. But yeah, guys, that'll do it for today. Uh... Pretty, a pretty awesome chapter pretty short but uh nonetheless pretty pretty good i liked it a lot and yeah gonna hopefully continue this series uh look out for another one of these videos in a couple days and uh yeah that should do it for today if you haven't already i have a twitch the link is in the description go follow me on there and uh yeah remember to like comment and subscribe until next time guys See you later.